Hello YouTube and welcome back. Today I'll be showing you how to install Red Logic, which is a replacement for the Red Power, um, the Logic, like the, all the wires and stuff. Uh, as you can see, this is uh, pictures of it right here. And so to start off, you're going to want to go to the first link, which will bring you to Minecraft Forge forms, and then go to Releases. And then go to uh, Forge 7.8.1 or whatever the newest version for you is. Uh, as of now, that's it for me. And then just go ahead and download directly. Uh, I'm just going to download this because I forgot to download that ahead of time. But once you're done with that link, you can go to the second link, which will bring you here. And you can read all this if you want. This is unfinished stuff. And this is the temporary recipes right here. Uh, so you can look through all that if you want. Um, now if you want to just install it, go ahead and click Downloads. And that will bring you here. So you're going to need the IMMIBIS core. And you're going to need the... Well, the Microblocks is optional. Uh, you don't have to install it, but uh, I'll be showing you how to install that as well. And then you're going to need the Red Logic. Alright, so once you got all that, let me just drag that onto my desktop. Once you got all that, you should have these right here, and these. So, what you're going to want to do is go to Start, or Windows key and R if you're on Windows, and type in percent app data percent, hit enter, and your Roman folder should pop up. So, what you want to do is go into dot .minecraft, go into bin, go into minecraft dot or minecraft dot jar um, now I already have uh, minecraft forge installed on this because um, I installed it when I was doing the hats mod so all you'd have to do if you had to install minecraft forge as well is just go ahead and open minecraft forge with winrar or 7zip or whatever you use and just copy all these classes into here like this. You know what? I'll even I'll even do it and I'll just replace the older ones. So you just drag them in like that and let it go through its process of installing. And once this is done, you will have Minecraft Forge installed and go uh go ahead and click yes there. That's just uh 7-zip asking if you want to install it, uh, which you do. Um, so now Minecraft Forge is out of the way. So now if you go to your dot .minecraft again, go into core mods. Um, I already have uh, not enough items installed, but you don't need that. That's optional. Uh, it does help though. So the only um, folder or file that goes into the core mods folder is the microblocks file. That is the only one. Uh, let me just copy that to my desktop, sorry. Alright, so now that you're done with that one, now go into your mods folder, and the um, this one, the core, and the red logic file, both go into the mods folder. Um, I don't know why the core goes in the mods folder, but the microblocks goes into the uh, other folder, but it does. Alright, so now we got all of these installed, as you saw. So now, we can go ahead and run Minecraft. So just let that load. Alright, and then log in. Alright, as you see, uh, Forge Mod Loader is setting up your Minecraft environment. Uh, so this does take a while for me, as I do have a slower computer. But I will be back once it is loaded up. Alright, so as you can see, uh, it's all loaded up. And if I go into mods, you will see that I have the micro blocks and the micro blocks again. And then the core and red logic. So now I'm going to single player. I open this world. I will just show you that I it did correctly install and that it isn't there.
this isn't the world I thought it was. But, anyways, go into creative mode plus. So, sorry about this. So, as you can see, it got a screwdriver, a ha uh, hacksaw, I got all these wires, and I got some gates here. Now, not all the gates are finished, as you saw it said, but a lot of them are here. Um, Alright, so that's it for this tutorial. If it helped, please comment, rate, subscribe. And if you need help with any other mod installation, go ahead and send me a message on YouTube or you can comment on this video. Either way, I'll get it and I will help you out. Alright, bye.